everyone and welcome. In this video, we are going to configure an NFS share on Windows Server that can be consumed by vSphere. First thing I need to do is add in the role that will allow me to share out a folder using NFS protocol. This is going to be a role on our server. I'm going to expand out file and storage services and once again expand out file and iSCSI. And if I look under here, we can see server for NFS. Select that. Add the features which allows us to have the config tools installed. Okay, the role is installed. That's excellent. I can close out. Now that the role has been installed, we need to configure the share. Click on file and storage services. Select shares. There are a number of different ways to start the new share wizard. I'm going to right click and new share. This is going to be an NFS quick share. Click next. We're going to specify the path, which is going to be on the E drive and NFS data. Click next. We will keep that name. And here we are not going to have server authentication, so I will select that and also enable unmapped user access. Click Next. We're going to add in some permissions for the share, in this case, all machines. The encoding we want is Big Five. We're going to allow read write access. And we're going to select allow root access. Uh, this is not recommended because this means we're going to allow the client to authenticate using the root user. And that is not a great thing to do since credentials must be sent across the network. However, this is something that vSphere requires, so we do that. Click on add. That is the only permission that we need. Click next. These permissions are fine. And we are ready to create and close. And that's all we need to do. Here is our share. Hopefully this has been helpful for you. And we'll see you next time.